My legislation um, seeks to create a $10 million investment in hybrid learning, creates a hybrid learning entrepreneurial fund. Um, and really we seek to use existing dollars um, to spark this innovation. Essentially, you have these three stations in which students are taking online coursework or working one-on-one -on -one with, with an instructor and then working in collaboration with one another. And what this really does is it, it, it empowers students, it empowers teachers by customizing, individualizing um, the, the learning experience for our students. I have a three-year-old son who already can navigate my iPhone to find his Thomas the Tank Engine videos. Young people today are growing up very comfortable with technology, um, and technology does have the power of the high-quality educator to customize a learning experience. We shouldn't check that technology, in my view, at the classroom door. This allows us for students, uh, allows the opportunity for students to really to work at their own pace. And so it's competency based. And I think that's the power behind it. And, and, and what we are seeing is significant academic gains on statewide assessments for students who are experiencing hybrid learning.